Today we are back on the channel with Holly BB's Family Vacation Build Challenge. You have to roll the dice, pick a theme, and then build. So I rolled the dice, I got a one, I got the tropical getaway theme. I was super excited about this and um, even though it says to not use custom content, I said, you know, this is my game and I want to play my way. So I downloaded the new Island Paradise um, for Granite. Falls. So that's where we're building. Um, it's on that little corner lot and I loved it. It's like this beautiful tropical, like almost Hawaii, I guess. It's like volcanoes in the background. It's just perfect for the tropical look that I was looking for. So I'm, instead of doing a speed build, I'm doing a walkthrough. So I'm just going to walk through the house. I'm going to explain and, and just like guide you through the house. So this is the atrium. It is a beautiful open air, two story um, garden basically with some lava rocks and just I had a really good time building it. The fountain was not in the original floor plans for the house that I used for inspiration but um, because of the way that the pools work in The Sims 4 of course I had to um, play around with it a little bit and so the fountain is there so there's not a bunch of empty space. I love the porch swings. They are my favorite. Um, I, I like to include them in all of my builds if I can. Um, and so I did. So this is the exterior of the guest house. And then this is the walk up from like if you're coming from the beach. We're passing the grotto, which is a beautiful um, pool on ground level with a diving rock and all that good stuff. Very natural, very beautiful. Um, the view from this pool deck is amazing um, and the reason why I use the house that I used so awesome the um, hot tub is not really navigatable but it is beautiful and it looks a lot like what I was going for um, briefly into the kitchen and the sitting area um, I mean the views here all of these open areas are just amazing in this home so this is the media room it's got this big um, custom uh, entertainment wall, if you will, and then out to the pool deck, a nice little place. So if you need to um, hang out, if it's raining, how sometimes you'll get those afternoon storms. And I just love all of the openness of this build. So if you go into, this is the first of two like child rooms on this floor, on this story. Um, I just used a lot of the um, part of the rules where that you use the parenthood stuff. So that's where um, some of the parenthood stuff comes in. I feel like you could probably go ahead and look at this. This is amazing. You could probably go ahead and turn one of these into a toddler room if you wanted. Um, they're just, you know, they're they're identical but I wanted to pop into each of them for the video tour I believe we are looking into the little guest bath on this floor right here I had a lot of fun with that um, and now we're gonna head upstairs to the third floor where we will find the main living our main bedrooms spaces this is the ocean view deck um, it's beautiful and this is where I would stay if I was staying in this house this bathroom you walk into the shower you know so you can like chain you know shower off all the sand before you come into your beautiful bedroom with a nice view these balconies are amazing um, the tropical plants the view of the pool and the rest of the island is just so beautiful so we're gonna walk straight across into the other bedroom space not bad at all I love the blue and it is also like the airy curtains just really nice um, the bathroom is kind of plain in this one but you know you don't have to have a luxurious bathroom in every space um, I really focused on that one big large bathroom that I told you guys was my favorite we're gonna pop outside real quick and um, this is just a separate entrance and then the um, gym for the facility is also located here um, we couldn't fit the rock wall in there but you feel free to to add that if you want to um, again we're gonna pop around the underside of this was all added um, I added the outdoor cooking space and the fountain but the theater was definitely in the original build so a nice little theater where you can sit and watch movies 
walk across this beautiful pond, make a wish while you're at it. Here's the outdoor grilling area that I was speaking about. Um, and then you go around, that's the bathroom. We just passed an outdoor shower. And now we're gonna head into the guest house. Um, it's a three bedroom guest house. Um, there's five bedrooms in the main house and then three bedrooms in here, so eight total. This is my second favorite room in the house. Um, I love it. It's ground floor, so you can walk straight to the beach. It's got its nice little splash pool, its own personal lounge area. Really nice. Um, we are going back around to see the, um, I like to think of it as the handicap accessible room. Like if you have grandma and grandpa along on the trip, they can definitely get in here. Anyone who's on crutches or in a wheelchair could definitely get into this room and into this bathroom. It's perfect for all families of all kinds of makeups because you know sometimes we just have like extended families and and if you're renting a house this big you're going to take everyone with you so now we're going to go ahead and go on back into the guest house i know the it's not very organized a quick little sitting area and a little separate kitchen there um it's a full kitchen there's a bathroom down there as well these rooms are um very much the same this is a kind of plain room i feel like would be like a child's room and then this room is very plain but the view is amazing so you could totally get me in there and then in the basement of the guest house we have the spa facilities so um, around that corner you will find bathrooms like locker rooms kind of situation I wanted to get some shots of the grotto with the um, run it's with the water running so you can see the waterfall going into over the natural rocks and cliffs and into the pool the beautiful view I mean you just can't get enough of that view back up to the pool the mirror finish on this pool is amazing um, I could just imagine sitting here having a tropical drink I mean amazing beautiful outdoor eating kitchen area the kitchen is huge it's got like room for six to sit at the bar and then we got another eight at the table just plenty of room for your whole family or a group of people to come if you wanted to have a bunch of um, couples get together or if like college kids wanted to come on spring break. I mean, it is amazing, uh, just amazing. In the original um, inspiration piece, they have a butler that comes with it as well as maid service daily. So that's kind of awesome. So I'm just getting like that view from the kitchen, like, and this is the little butler's pantry. There's a little ice cream machine there. And I just love that mod that allows me to put stuff on top of the microwave because it's so realistic. So you have a little bit of herbs on there. We're going back up to visit my favorite space. One last time before we get on to the screenshots that are going to be along with the inspiration shots for this build. I can't wait for you guys to see them. Let me know what you think. Did I do a pretty good job? And um, I hope that you enjoy those. So let's go look at the screenshots. Here is my kitchen and the inspiration kitchen that big master bedroom and bathroom that I just loved I mean who wouldn't want to stay in this amazing room in this amazing house look at that just look at the view it's beautiful here's the media room and the theater and the inspiration here's that guest master bedroom and splash pool amazing right the sitting room and a view from in and out of the sitting room in the inspiration house here's the atrium and the ocean view deck i mean that's a view here's the pool don't you just want to sit out there with a tropical drink and just watch the waves break I'll leave you with this small video of my sim jumping into the grotto. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you like me and want to be my friend, subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell so you'll get my videos that I post almost every day. Until tomorrow, bye.